Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Sydney Marlowe Weeks and today we are doing neon summer makeup. So getting right into the tutorial, I am using my SMW Collection Oil Elixir. All products will be listed in the description box below, but I'm just using this oil for extra moisturization and also giving me a dewy finish. Now I'm using the NYX Setting Spray as a primer and I am using the Evian Misting Spray. I've been obsessed with this to add some extra moisturization as well. I'm following up with the LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Fawn. This is just going to cover any hyperpigmentation, discoloration, or scarring, and I'm just going to buff that out with my Real Techniques blending sponge. So y'all know the drill, I'm using my L'Oreal True Match in W7 and I'm applying that with my fingers. I'm going to blend that out with an e.l.f. foundation brush and then sop up any excess product with my Real Technique sponge. Now I'm using my LA Girl Pro Concealer in the shade Yellow Corrector and I love using this product because it really brightens underneath the eye. We're not using any powder today so I really want to make sure everything is bright but it's also going to give me some coverage as well. So now I'm going in with my ABH Cream Contour Kit in the Deep Kit using the shades Carob and Chocolate. Y'all know the drill. This is a holy grail for me, a staple of mine and my routine. If you guys would like to see a highlight and contour video, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and I'll definitely do it for you guys. I'm now using the NYX concealer in the color Fair and I love this because it definitely gives me coverage, it brightens underneath my eyes and it also allows me to clean up my contour without having to use powder. Getting into this eyebrow routine, I am using my MAC Fluid Line in the color Black Track with an angled brush if you want a more in-depth tutorial where I show you all of my tips, tricks, and basics on how to do your eyebrows. I have a video. Go check that out. It's definitely going to bless you.
Now that we are done with our brows, I really wanted to do a neon look because I know like neon clothes is trending, even neon hair is trending, so why not do neon makeup? I got this pressed glitter pigment from Sephora. I will have the brand linked down below. It is literally the prettiest shade I've ever seen. So I said, let's do a look with this. Look at this, look at this pigment, y'all. Like what? So I'm just taking a small focus brush and applying that pigment straight onto my lid. I'm going to use the other blending side of the brush to kind of blend it into my crease. I love the iridescence of this pigment and you can totally stop here for a more natural look. But honey, today and for the rest of the summer, we are going bold with all neon color. So what I'm going to do I'm going to take this crayon. It is more so like a chalky feel on the eye. I'm going to have the shade linked down below, but this is a crayon stick from the Sephora collection. I don't know the name of it, but it is like this lime green. I saw it from the Notorious KIA and I absolutely fell in love. I tried applying it with a brush. I didn't like it that way, so I just found that it was much easier to apply it with just the crayon stick. And I applied two coats, so I did a wing the first time and then I went back with a second coat here. So after I apply my eyeliner on my top lid, I am then going to pop on some Ardell Wispies right here and then I'm using my NARS, this is the multi stick in the color Orgasm, just to add a little bit of cream blush. In the spring and summertime, I try to stay away from powders and stick more to cream based products. Now I am taking another staple of mine. This is the Cover FX Liquid Highlighting Drops and I absolutely love these. I'm using it in the shade Rose Gold. So y'all know it wouldn't be a tutorial of mine without setting my face with MAC Gold Deposit. I love using this pigment to set my face. Instead of making me look super matte and compact and cakey, it makes me look very dewy and glowy and fresh faced. Now I am using the Jeffree Star Highlighter. This thing is gorgeous. Look at that pigment. It has the same green iridescence as our glitter shadow that we used. And I'm just going to be applying this with an angle brush onto my cheeks, my nose, and all of the other high points of my face. Going back in with our neon green crayon shadow, I'm applying that to my waterline and then I am just going to add that excess glitter already in the brush. I'm not taking any more pigment, but I'm going to take the excess glitter and then just blend it out on my waterline just to blend it seamlessly but give it a pop of color as well. And then I'm going to add Maybelline's Lots of Lashes to my bottom lashes and my top lashes. So I have a question, does anyone else make these crazy faces when you're applying like mascara or you know things in your waterline or you know eyeliner, those different types of things? Cause I be hooting and hollering when I'm editing like Sydney, why are you making these faces? Like that eye right there, what is that? Lastly, I'm going to be applying this lip pencil from NYX in the color Truffle and then I am using the e.l.f. lip liqueur. It's just clear gloss. It's a dollar at Target. It's amazing. I love it so much. It is just so great. Like look at look at the shine. Do y'all see that shine? Like my lip gloss is popping. Lil Mama would be proud, okay? Then I'm just going to set my face with the Evian Misting Spray and I'm going to be applying the Glossier Boy Brow onto my eyebrows just to finish them off and that is it. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments below how you're doing and don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Join our family, okay? I love you so much. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.